Barati 4 and Carlin is a trio consisting of the vocalist Christian Barati, pianist Sean Foran, and the saxophonist Raphael Carlin. We formed in 2014. We'd known each other for many years, actually, and we had a few gigs together in Brisbane and, and put the group together because it just seemed like a really interesting combination of instruments and we wanted to keep making music together that uh, was kind of different to some of our other projects. Our first album was called Hope in My Pocket and was the result of some research that we did into Anzac Correspondence. I'm holding on, holding on to the picture of you, keeping you close to my heart. The songs were written, kind of drawn on themes that we found in Anzac letters that we researched at the State Archives in Queensland, and so it had quite a really intense emotional kind of context to the work, but it was, it was quite well received and a really beautiful album to make. For our latest album, um, Haven, we teamed up with the amazing vibraphone player, Pascal Schumacher from Luxembourg. He's an outstanding performer and lovely person, so we're very, very excited to work with him. We spent quite a bit of time in the lead up thinking about how we could best utilize uh, his, his unique playing and the sound of the vibraphone with within this unit so obviously piano vibraphone voice and saxophone is a bit of an unusual format so it left a lot of um, space for us to think how, how can we distribute the material who can be doing what how can we share roles and the, the outcome was really nice I think it's a nice complete sound world obviously you have to shift your ears because we're not uh, hard swinging group and we don't have drums so it has a very different feeling to the whole album but there's a beautiful transparency to it and it has real pleasure playing with all these lovely lovely musicians approached Pascal and he was into it. He was really keen and um, I think that makes a really big difference when you're trying to do a project just in general but also something like this where you're not in close proximity. Um, you're going to have to kind of fight for the whole thing to, <laughs> to really actually happen. So knowing that he was super on board was a really uh, like it fueled us to to keep um, moving toward the goal um, of making this album with him. Each piece has a really distinctive mood and explores uh, specific melodic or harmonic environments which are thoroughly explored and everyone was able to slot into those moods really, really easily. It was, it's a luxury being able to bring in something with you know, quite dense harmony and um, all the performers could put it together really quickly and find their, their voice inside some thorny or or um, quite dense and dark chords. Similarly, having uh, simple triads here and there uh, doesn't feel thin because the players would always do something exciting with it. The album reflects that there's a nice variety 
within it, but there's coherence uh, with how everyone approaches the material and leaves space. So this album was recorded in 2017, which is a shock to all of us when we think about it. We uh, had this whirlwind time with Pascal. He came out here, we recorded, then we did a national tour here in Australia. because um, each of us uh, have our own careers and um, our own tours going on, plus Pascal is like a super mega jazz star in Europe, um, it's meant that it's taken till 2020 for this to come out. So um, it's coming out uh, on Earshift Music, which is a wonderful label from Oz. And we have score books, which we did for our last album, and people seem to really dig, so we thought we'd do that again. And we have CDs, and we're really excited about how this album sounds as well. There's a real European kind of flavor to the actual, the mixing and the mastering, which um, I think is really unusual. Um, and yeah, it's, it's kind of cool, so we're hoping people think the same. <laughs>